All right, don't mind my dirty bedspread. Um, this is going to be my makeup collection, my current one. You know, I've purged a ton. I did a lot of e-div trades the last half of last year. I've also just did a huge back to Mac. Um, I'll show you what I got for my back to Mac. I finally did that. Um, given a lot of stuff away. Yeah, emptied. So this is my makeup collection. is isn't anything crazy, but I'm going to show you what I have. So the first stuff that I'm going to show you is all stuff in my everyday makeup bag, which is this Torrid bag I got a very long time ago. It's like a travel size bag and I just keep the stuff that I'm using at the time in there so I'm gonna put everything over here so I'm gonna try to steady this as much as possible because I know people get dizzy and let's get started so some of the brushes let me throw all the brushes let's see okay so obviously you can see I, I use a lot of elf brushes this elf studio brush and then the small stipple, which I absolutely love for blush. And then this is the stipple brush, which I use for bronzer. Um, use that constantly. These are some Hello Kitty ones that I got um, for Christmas. And I actually really love this brush because you get the inner corner of your eyes. And I use it for like a highlight color. This one's okay. This, I don't think I've used it maybe once. Um, it, ca it came in my Naked palette. Um, I need to start using it. And then this is just the L foundation brush. Um, and then I just have a little doodad, like a little eyebrow brush. Um... Is that all the brushes I have in there? Yes. Okay, the next thing is the e.l.f. contouring blush and bronzer, but I only have the blush left. And this is the only blush I own, which is crazy, right? But I love that blush. It looks nice on my skin tone when I'm paler or if I'm tan, and I love it. And it's a $3 studio product, and it's amazing. Um, I am trying to finish. This is quite old. The Stila SPF 30. This is a medium oil-free sheer color tinted moisturizer. You see how old this is? Um, I believe we're down to here, so I just need to finish this up and get it out of here. Um, for eyebrows, NYC Eyebrow Kit. Got this from Thrifty Beauty page, and it's all right. Um, some MAC pigments. This is Mutiny. And then, I don't even know. I know it's Viz de Violet, and I think Fuchsia in that one. Just the Urban Decay sharpener it's the best thing for your 24 7 pencils speaking of 24 7 pencils i have three in my everyday um of course i have zero and then i started using a brown which is really nice um demolition and then i've been using this purple one which is vice i had a lighter purple one and then i've been using the kat von d tattoo pencil um in this beautiful color Mascara, I'm only using one right now, and I'm using my Buxom. Um, what is this? True Black Sculpted Lash Mascara. I got this in a $10 set. I also have an eyeliner to go with it uh, for Black Friday at Sephora. So I've been using that up. I've been using the e.l.f. Eyelid Primer. Um, and then, let's see... Uh, baby lips in this sheer color and this is I don't even know it's a crystal one it doesn't have a name on it but I just apply it before I'm about to put my um, makeup on and then this is a Mac tender tone in pucker and let me see if I can get the top yeah oh I'm good it's a red and it's really nice and it's not sticky it's very moisturizing and I put it in there to start using it more um, boy, do I really love it. I'm going to have to put that on after. The bronzer I'm using right now is the Hoola Benefit Bronzer. I cannot tell you how long I've used this. Um, this is crazy that the sample is still going. And it is quite dark. You have to be light-handed. You could see I've used a lot. You could see the metal. But I still got a way to go on it. So... This was a Dollar Tree find. It's the All May, and it's a salicylic acid um, treatment acne gel that I use at that time of the month. I get, like, two pimples on my chin. And then this is a concealer, which is actually not bad, so I put that in there. A few lip products. Um, the first thing I started to try to use, again, is the MAC. This is the MAC 
I know it's a holiday palette. It has five lipsticks, Junior Miss, High Strung, Creme de la Femme, Captive and Fluid, and two glosses, Tool and Vintage Violet. And um, I love these. And it looks like that. And it's absolutely gorgeous. And you see I have dips in all of it. Um, I've been trying to use it. Use your old things, guys. Um, this was from a Target box. It's the Revlon... Ultra HD Lip Lacquer and Petalite. I pulled it out for spring. It's gorgeous. And then I got Her Fancy, which is MAC. This is a wearable pink. So I have this in there to wear. And um, then as for what's in my purse, um, I have the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in Istanbul. Istanbul. As part of a Christmas gift. Then I have this, which is an Essence Dazzle Glow Triple XL Gloss, and it goes on top of what I got from my Back to Mac, which I got a Luster in Pretty Please. This is what I picked out, and with that on top is gorgeous. Um, I never used a Luster, and it doesn't stay on as well as the other types of MAC lipsticks I've used, but it was free. So, And then I have the e.l.f. Mineral Lip Gloss in... Oh natural and this is gorgeous too especially in spring summer so that's why it's in my everyday and then of course I have the naked palette I earned $50 rewards at Black Friday time I purchased $12 for a travel size trio of 24 7 pencils and I got a $50 rewards um, and I ended up getting the naked palette for $12 I've been using it as you can tell and I got Mika, it was wet, my brush, and it kind of ruined this. I need to figure out how to use this. But as you can tell, Sin is my favorite, and um, there's a big dip in that. <laughs> and then I have an Ulta um, holiday palette, and this is the Urban Decay Book of Shadows 4 or something. I actually started using these again yesterday. I need to use these shadows. Um, yeah, so that's my everyday makeup. And now... The rest of my makeup is in a Victoria's Secret bag, which is random, I know, but it works. So I'm just going to pull things out for you and show you. This is going to be super long. I saved the naked box. I don't know why. That's a mirror. That's, I also have e.l.f. brush shampoo. I keep all makeup-related stuff in there. Um, I also have the spray kind, too, the, um, the daily cleanser. So this little thing... Ulta bag. I keep full sizes and liners, stuff that could get lost easily in that big bag. So let me pull all this out. Oh my gosh, this is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. This is really... Oh, I put brushes in here too. Okay. I feel a little bit better. So I have... I haven't tried this yet. I got this in Christmas. I asked my dad, or maybe I purchased this, Kat Von D Autograph Pencil in Puro Amour. It's her black. And it also has a smudge brush on the end. So I have that. Um, I also have a full-size 24-7 pencil in Ransom, which is this beautiful purple. Um, I might keep that out. My favorite, but I use zillions, and I was trying to use something else, Urban Decay Perversion. Um... I have tons of pencils in here, so I'm going to show you all the eyeliner pencils. Oh, my God. Okay, first of all, I have another perversion. I didn't know I had two. I'm very excited about that. Um, this is the Pixie Black Noir pencil, and it looks very creamy, so I saved it. 24-7 in LSD. Gorgeous, gorgeous color. might keep that out, too. Then um, the 24-7 Velvet, Black Velvet, haven't tried that, um, got that. And then I have the, this is the Buxom pencil that goes with the mascara I'm using. Here's another 24-7 pencil in Perversion. Um, I never used Perversion, only zero. And then a Synthony, Cynthia Raleigh eyeliner. A lot of people said good things about. And then a, um, you can never have too many black eyeliners, so I actually saved these, even though I probably won't use this one either. The Samita Beauty Cantress eye pencil. I probably won't use the Pixie or that, but I save them because you go through a liner and you never know how good they're going to be good. How good they're going to be. This is a Dr. Jart BB Beauty Balm. I'm going to put this in my everyday makeup. This is a 
good time to organize. Um, and yep, two more brushes, an elf brush and another Hello Kitty brush. I have a Philosophy Cinnamon Buns, never used, never opened yet. Um, can't wait to use that. Elf Eyelid, Eyelid Primer, brand new. I'll use that after I use the one that I have. This was a present at Christmas. I honestly don't really like this mascara. I got a mini in my Itsy, Ipsy, and um, but it was a gift, and it's the latest camera lashes in Tarte, and maybe I'll like it this time. I don't know. Then I have a uh, Volume Express 1x1 one one Maybelline um, mascara. And then... I have a lip butter, NYX butter. I haven't opened this. This is from Ipsy, I believe, too. And then I have this Mayana Lip Locked Priming Gloss Stain. Heard really good things about this, but honestly, I can't figure out how to open it. <laughs> Sounds stupid, but it's true. So I got all that. Okay. And then I'm going to pull some of this out. Actually, I'm going to pull all this out. So if you're going to have a lull. I'll talk to you, though. Um... Honestly, when I start to look at everything that I have, you're getting a sneak peek of things. Um, <laughs> it all adds up, even though it's all small things and it's confined and you can fit it in a small thing. I mean, I honestly, now that I look at this, I really do still have a good amount of makeup. Nothing compared to, you know, other YouTube gurus, but I mean, this is all other stuff that's just sitting that's not in my everyday makeup. So I'm just going to pick, and then I'm just going to put it back in the bag because, do you see this? Okay. Let's do Bare Minerals. Okay, so I had a ton of Bare Minerals. I swapped a lot of it out, but um, this is just Mineral Veil, which I really should start using to set my face. So I'm going to put that in my everyday makeup bag. And then I have Tan, um, which I would mix with the Mineral Veil and kind of make a lighter color, but when I run out of bronzer... I'm going to use this. So, it's mineral makeup by last. Okay, some foundations. Wait, more foundations. I don't really use foundation, to be honest. Um, but I have this, which is the Clinique Super Balanced Makeup. There's not much left in here. And this is in Creme Cam Chimay. Um, it actually matches me, so for a really special event, I will wear that. And then, this is brand new. Um, cover girl, warm beige, sensitive skin. Um, this was given to me from my friend's grandma. She doesn't even know how she got it. It's brand new. Um, but this matches me perfectly as well. So, and I do tend to get sensitive skin sometimes. So I was happy that it was sensitive skin. This I'm going to use after I finish up the tinted moisturizer, but it's the Rimmel Stay Matte Liquid Mousse Foundation and Classic Beige. A little bit light for me, to be honest. Um, but I could actually use it for a highlighter, see how dirty that is. This is brand new. Haven't used this. The Visible Lift Repair Absolute Rapid Age Reversing. That's not why I got it. This is a natural beige. Um, I thought it was going to be a lot more product. I only paid $2, though. But um, can I open it? It comes with a little thingy, so that's why it wasn't as much as I thought. Um, I can't open it. Anyways, it's liquid. I don't know if you could see it. It's like a mousse consistency. Real cool. So I'm going to try to use that, but I'm focusing on that tinted moisturizer. Eyebrow. The only other eyebrow stuff I have is the e.l.f. eyebrow kit, and this is actually good too. But I decided to use the, um, other thing. Let me pull out brushes. What did I just throw? Brushes, 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 brushes. Eyelash curler. I don't use that either. I have curly lashes. I'm lucky. Okay, e.l.f. crease brush. Um, e.l.f. kabuki brush. Um, this is the crown brush that I got from Ipsy, and it actually is really good. I'm going to throw that on my everyday makeup bag. These two... Um, they're actually really good, these posh brushes. I save them. Um, e.l.f. blush and bronzer brush. Um, this is a Studio Gear eyeliner. I used to use the gel eyeliner. This brush was expensive as hell. I think, I forget how much it was, but, um, this is a really good brush. I don't use gel liner, but when I do again, I'm, that's why I'm saving that brush. This is an Origin, uh, blush brush. Really nice. Um, and then my, of course, Bare Minerals, uh, face brush and, like, stippling blending brush. 
Okay, next. <laughs> We're working through, guys. I told you, oh, this was going to be super long. All right, eyeshadows. So eyeshadow, eyeshadow, eyeshadow. I don't have a ton of eyeshadow um, anymore. But I have the Naked Palette. I have those two palettes uh, there in the pigments that I've shown you. And I also have these MAC pigments. I don't know what all the colors are, but these purples and pinks. Um, I have an Urban Decay Shattered, which used to be my favorite. It's a blue. And this is the old school packaging. Jane, this is the only reason why I'm keeping this is this is nostalgic to me. I used to wear this. I actually used to wear it really well too. Kind of wore a light color on my lid and then wore black eyeliner and then kind of put this above the black eyeliner. And this Jane um surfer girl i think it is yep surfer girl was my favorite and this was one that i found before jane rechain you know changed all their cosmetics and um this is nostalgic and i can't get rid of it this was from Paige as well. This is actually really nice. Um, this brown is real nice, but I have so many similar things in my Naked, but I really like this white cream. I might need it for something, so that's why I saved this. And then, of course, my two favorite trios, Walking on Eggshell. This is the third one I've purchased, and Sweet as Candy from Wet n Wild. So we have those, and then the Urban Decay Ammo Palette. I've also had the Wallpaper Palette, another thing that I finished in the past. Um, but this is just what I have now, but yeah, look at how much I used it. Look at Sin's Gone, Polyester Bride is Pan, Shatter's Almost Pan, um, uh, Maui Wowie's Pan, like, <laughs> that's old school right there, guys. That's old school. Um, this is the only concealer, I believe, I was using this, I'm not a real big fan, but it's a Physician's Formula Circle Concealer, saved it. I think the rest is all lips. Um, oh, this is a maximum coverage concealer brush from Bare Minerals that was stuck in there. Okay. Oh, no. I have eyes. Is that it? Um, this is just an e.l.f. long-lasting cream shadow in this color. I have that. Okay, lips. Nope. <laughs> NYC, this is... I was using this for a while. I just threw it back in the thing. Um, golden Champagne. It's very messy to work with, but gorgeous. Um... But, yeah, I just threw it back in my makeup bag. I got sick of using it. All right, so now I have baby lips. Baby lips. So I have these two baby lips as well. Um, Just pinks. And then a sugar palette, which these are not as scary as they look. I can't open it. But you can see they're glittery and stuff. But they do taste like sugar. Mac. Mac, 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 Mac. Okay, I just got rid of like eight or nine things to Mac, and I showed you the three, four that I have still. So what? Uh, I have like ten Mac products left. So this is a Hello Kitty lipstick. This is Strayin, and it's a frost. It's real nice, actually. And then I have the Hello Kitty um, gloss and Nice Kitty. That's almost gone. Um, then I have this, which is in, I think it's pink. Pink Poodle, yep. And then Shaboom, which is amazing. And then I actually have two of these. I don't know where the other one is. Um, and this is um, Amber Russ. Where the heck is the other one? And then I have um, Viva Glam 4. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Okay, and then I have some Beauty Rush glosses. I loved them. Um, and then this is Cupquake. And this is Slice of Heaven, which I used to love. Um, I have these from Bath and Body Works, which are really awesome, and they tingle, and they're cool. Um, the Pearl Mint and the Bear Mint, these are amazing if you haven't tried them before. I have a Benefit Bella Bamba. I have another NYX, um, Extreme Shine Lip Cream, and Nude Peach Fuzz. 
it's about to rain, so now the colors, the light's changing in here. Some e.l.f. lips, more e.l.f. lips. The Hyper Shine glosses I really like. Aren't they gorgeous? And then um, a matte lip color, and this is a coral. I had another one I didn't like as much, so I traded it. And then I have this one, Pout Perfector, which is tingles as well and glow, and this is nice. Another Essence Extreme um, Shine these are amazing and cheap at Ulta. And then a bath, I mean, a Wet n Wild, like a Burt's Bees kind of dupe natural blend lip shimmer. And then I just have these three Urban Decay Revolution lipsticks. So that is my collection. Only took 20 minutes. I thought it was pretty good. Um, I believe that's, I might have a few things here and there. You know, I didn't show you my EOS lip balms. I didn't show you, like, my Beauty Rush Tin Lip Balm. Um, and I have a few other lip products in my car, but this is pretty much everything. I mean, there's everything I just showed you there and everything in that container. So it's still a good amount, um, but I'm working through it. So I will talk to you guys later. I hope you enjoyed this. Hope it didn't make you sick. I try to keep it as still as possible. Bye.